Hey everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel getassist.net where I post troubleshooting videos and useful tutorials and in today's video, I will talk about how you can recover your Microsoft account if you have forgotten your password. I will also discuss if it is possible to recover your Microsoft account if you do not have access to your mobile number or email address. So without any further delay, let's get started with the video. Alright, to start with the recovery process, you have to go to Microsoft's website that is Outlook.com and here you need to click on sign in. Now on this screen, you have to enter your email address that you want to recover and then click on next. Now here, as you don't remember your password, you simply have to click on forgot password. Then you will get the option to reset your password. So the screen says we need to verify your identity. How would you like to get your security code? All right. So you will be shown the recovery options that are available, such as your recovery email address or your phone number. So you have to select the right option to which you can access and you can get the code. All right. So here I'm going to select my email as that is the only option available. And now to verify that this is your email address, you need to know the hidden part. All right. So you need to know your full recovery email address that you have added to your Outlook account. And that is what you have to enter right here. So I'm going to do that. And then click on get code. Now you need to log in to that Gmail account that you have just entered and you need to see if you have received any email from Microsoft. So that is the email that I have just received from Microsoft that has the code that you need to enter. So I'm going to do that. That's how you can do it. Now you are allowed to reset your password. You can easily create a new password and you can note it down somewhere. So that's the very basic method that you can use apart from that if you will cancel the process and now if we will restart to know what other options are available all right so i will show you if you can reset your password without email or phone number or not so now again you have to click on forgot password and now you have to click on i don't have any of these as you can see, you will be directed to a new page where you will be asked, asked a few more questions so that they can help you to recover your Outlook account. So luckily, it is possible to recover your Outlook account without using your recovery email address or phone number. So what you need to do here is your Outlook account that you want to recover is already mentioned as you can see. All right. Or you can even change it if you want. And then you need to provide a new email address. All right. So it says where should we contact you enter an email address that's different from the one you are trying to recover so you have to give any other email address and then you have to enter the characters that you can see and then you have to click on next so let's do that once you do that you will see this message that we just sent a code to your new email address check your email for a message from the microsoft account team and enter the code here so let's do that so here is the other email that i have received on my other email account that i have just entered all right here is security code so now you need to enter the new code that you have received so once you are done entering the code click on verify and now as you can see you will be asked a few more information to finally verify that the account belongs to you all right so you need to provide your first name your last name your birth date your country your state your territory all right and your postal code and that's all you need to do you have to answer as many questions as you can in order to get back to your account so that they can verify the information that you have provided to them and if it matches then you will be able to reset a new password for your microsoft account so that was all for today's topic i hope you found this video helpful and if you do don't forget to hit the subscribe button and also press the bell icon to stay notified of all my upcoming videos if you have any doubts issues or queries do let me know in the comment section down below and for now i will take the leave we'll see you the next time